first, I would like to thank the RSOG for inviting me to give a talk today. The great transformation the world is undergoing at present, particularly in the ASEAN region. It is safe to say that we are now experiencing a great transformation of the world system by many new development happenings at an international level, especially in the sphere of economy, security, and socio culture. Although I'm supposed to be talking about the Asian sociocultural community blueprint, especially in the context of the presently emerging new world system. The ASEAN Declaration of 1967 expressed its objective as follows. Number one, to accelerate economic growth, social progress and cultural development in the region. How can ASEAN achieve this ideal idea when each member state has their own social uh, set of social security system which uh, put a greater advantage to their own nationalities and uh, over, the, over the other member states? I think this is the beginning of a long process to create uniformity of a lot of things in ASEAN under ASEAN. How much resistance has there been from the nation, member nations, towards social integration to create an ASEAN identity when a lot of these countries seem to be struggling to find their own national identity. First, we have our own culture as an ethnic group. And ASEAN is bringing a new culture, the universal culture that we have to subscribe. <laughs>